this is Keely from the Branch District Library and I'm going to show you another simple science experiment that you can do at home. Today I'm making homemade ice cream in a bag. Now there are a lot of different recipes out there for ice cream in a bag so you can absolutely adjust this experiment to your needs. The recipe that I'm using today is one cup of half and a half, two tablespoons of sugar, and one teaspoon of vanilla extract. Whatever recipe you decide to use, you will need two different sizes of Ziploc bags, a quart size and a gallon size, a lot of ice, and salt. Chunkier salt like rock salt is easiest to use, but table salt like this also works fine. So this is a very simple experiment. All you need to do is combine your ice cream ingredients into the smaller bag and zip it up very, very tightly so that it doesn't leak. Fill your larger bag partway with ice and add one third cup of salt. Then just place your smaller bag inside your larger one. Seal it up really, really tightly. Then wrap it in a towel. You may want to consider wearing gloves at this point to protect your hands from the cold. Then all you need to do to make ice cream is shake the bag. Keep shaking for about 15 to 20 minutes until your ice cream starts looking like ice cream. Adding salt to ice lowers its freezing point causing it to melt. This is exactly like when you salt a road in winter. As the ice in our bag melts, it draws in heat from the environment around it. This causes water vapor to condense on the outside of the bag and also causes our ice cream to freeze. You can enjoy your ice cream with any of your favorite toppings. Just be careful when you open the bag not to get any salt. All right, I hope you enjoyed this video. For more from BDL, visit our website at branchdistrictlibrary.org or follow us on Facebook.